You've heard of paying it forward. Well, how about playing it forward? Singer-songwriter Caroline Cole is back with us on Daytime to share what Instruments of Change is all about. Good to have you back here. So happy to be back. Thank you. We had some members of Instruments of Change mm -hmm. on the show a few weeks ago, and uh, you're involved with them now. Tell us more about your involvement and tell us about the organization. Well, um, it's an event that's benefiting Instruments of Change, which is an organization that um, really gives at-risk kids a chance for musical education, life education, just really getting them in some great things through music. And it, I'm super excited to be a part of it. Everybody there is so nice and great. It'll be a benefit concert at the Strass Center on the 16th. Nice. So I hope y'all can come. Yeah, so now <laughs> t t tell us why it's important for you to be a part of this. Well, music is a, such a major point of my life. So to see that you know this organization is making music a part of at-risk kids' lives too is really cool. And so I want to help that in any any way I can. I mean, just to show them what hard work and motivation and determination can get you and having that goal and having that dream, it's really honoring and humbling for me to do. Caroline, how old are you now? I'm 16. All of 16. And I think you, you asked her that the last time <laughs> she was here, and I think that she was 16 then, too. Well, she <laughs> seems older and wiser than her years, and it's she great. Does. But yeah, how no. much has music impacted your life personally, and when did you start getting involved? I started getting involved in music, um, well actually, I guess you could say I've been involved my whole life, because we've always loved listening to it. But when I was eight years old, I myself picked up the guitar and started writing and started making trips to Nashville at 10, where we just relocated, and mm -hmm. then starting the tour with Reba, we're actually going back on the road with her Friday. Nice. So Oklahoma. exciting. Right? I know. <laughs> so it's just great to have so many opportunities. and it. I mean, it makes me a better person, I think. You know, and you are so mature for your age, and, and you're so talented. Thank you. you. You really are. And, you know, most people would say, well, wait a second, are you really giving up your childhood? And this young lady just told us before we started this segment, during the commercial break, that what's happening tonight? Tonight I'm being inducted into the National Honor Society. How about wow. that? So you did not... Uh, slack on the the education at all. No, I try not to. <laughs> Good for you. Well, let's Thank talk you. about touring with Reba McIntyre. I mean, sh obviously, what an icon. What has she taught you about the business? Well, um, there's been many occasions where I've been face-to-face -face with her. Face-to-face. Mm -hmm. -face. <laughs> right. <laughs> Sorry. And um, she told me that we're not that different, which was really cool. Just, you know, when you get when you get to be a part of the music business, you kind of face the same struggles. You know, you face rejection and you face some really, really high points and exciting points points and turning points. So to hear that from her was mm. amazing because she is an icon yeah. and I look up to her in so many ways. She's such a beautiful person and it's it's really amazing. What's going through your mind when you're up on stage and, and say you're you're opening for Reba McIntyre and you have that whole audience in front of you? What what's going through your head? Please don't let me forget the words. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that and um, I hope they like me. <laughs> but I have a feeling even if you did forget a word or two, you would be able to improvise somehow and get yourself out of that. And then I start doing interpretive dance. There you go. Yeah. You know, there you go. It's all in the way you roll with it, right? <laughs> exactly. Absolutely. Well, so again, congratulations. Instruments of Change, big charity concert mm -hmm. happening again. November 16th at the Straz Center. And tickets are still available, so Good. get them. Yes. Right. While who they're else still besides there. you, really quickly, who else besides you is performing? Um, we're going to have bars and guitars and some other local acts nice. that are going on before me. And I think you all have had some on your show already. Okay, Beautiful. We're, we're going to hear uh, Caroline right after the break, so you'll want to stick around. Be right back.